everyone, welcome back to our last weekly video regarding, um, again, the field of geography, uh, individuals and society, our revision basically week. Now to start off, we're going to basically be dealing with various concepts of vocabulary word regarding the final or our E1 basically exam, geography, physical geography, cultural geography, the difference between them, a uh, couple of resources like GPS, GIS, time, place, which is a the theme of our unit, scientific and technical innovations, progress, location, uh, remote sensing, uh, certain basically philosophers, well-known contributors in the field of geography. And we're going to talk about basically um, the navigation itself, effects, and um, basically some positive contributions in alignment with the field itself. And now regarding our E1 exam, the um, unit is going to be listed into different lessons. So lesson one, we're going to deal with the field of geography. Again, it has what geography is, the history of geography and some aims uh, for studying basically geography. And these are a couple of guided questions that would help you throughout the lesson itself. So what is the broad scope of or definition of geography as an academic basically discipline? Now in regard to our second units about the contribution of various Arab scholars to the field of ge geography itself. So we're going to talk about uh, various contributors of Muslim travelers and traders, the invention of the astrolabe itself. So again, coupled with guided questions like in what ways did Arab scholars contribute to the development of cartography, for example, as a field itself, and what were their notable achievements in map making itself. So we're going to talk about a lot of famous and well-known names. Uh, we're going to talk and delve with uh, basically some scientific knowledge um, as such as astronomy, mathematics, into the contribution again to it to basically geographical studies. As you can see here, we're going to mention and um, match most famous and ancient geographers in the uh, and their contributions throughout history itself. Again, we have Strabo and Idrisi, Alexander. Um, again, we're going to talk a lot of um, a lot of them about a lot of them. And again, um, we're going to talk about specific achievements um, to each one of uh, these famous contributors too. Last then we're going to talk about the difference between physical and cultural uh, features generally or characteristics. Uh, we're going to have, uh, and we had again classroom discussions, a lot of classroom discussions about certain uh, basically fields. Um, some of the guided questions are going to be providing is what are some examples of physical features on earth, mountains, rivers, and uh, can you provide examples of cultural features in the shape of landscapes and we're going to talk about both physical and cultural features of certain, again, regions changed, um, that changed over time. And in regard to physical and human geography, we're going to talk about certain subfields and subcategories. And we're going to talk about human activities, physical environment, surroundings, uh, the influence in life, urbanization, climate influence, again, uh, in regard to cultural practices and economic activities. As a conclusion to our unit, we're going to link geography and technology by talking about geographic information systems like remote sensing at some point. And we're going to, again, answer a lot of guarded questions to do technologies such as GPS, GIS, enhance the efficiency and accuracy of geographical feedwork and data collection.